you all remember Wilt. Hey, Miles. Uh, remember when I said I knew someone who's looking into the underground? She's on the line. You're not strong enough for us! Hi, uh, Spider-Man? I'm Danica Hart. I'm planning a podcast series on the underground and... So I checked this location against local crime reports, and guess what? A while back, the Magia and an unidentified group, obviously pre-Tinkerer Underground, got into a shootout here. Underground went after the Magia? Like the crime families? They wanted respect. Makes sense they try and jump ahead by gunning for the ruling class.
There. Now to find the jammer. I should be able to track the wires with my suit. Wire runouts are a good place to start. There's a pulley over those crates. Magia Trophy Room. <laughs> Thought you could hide, huh? <laughs> Poker chips. Definitely the old crime family style. Green's a little off on these bills. Guess the Maja never nailed down their counterfeiting operation. I found the jammer. Guess I can head out. Way out's blocked. Should I call someone? Like, like backup? I'll figure it out. That old elevator could be my ticket out of here. Just need some juice. Running trap has failed. Hey, consider the jammer jammed. Perfect. Now I'm just gonna give the police an anonymous tip, and boom! No more hideouts. Appreciate the help. Did you get what you needed? Yep. I'm gonna dig some more into this turf war between the underground and the Magia. Smells like a story. Sounds good. I'm looking forward to hearing the podcast. Get back to looking for the new form. Time to hit the theater. Folks, the Feast Centers have had a rough go ever since their founder, Martin Lee, turned out to be the mad bomber known as Mr. Negative. But I believe in the Feast Centers because I knew May Parker, the brave woman who literally gave her life to keep them going. So I was distressed to hear the Harlem branch recently suffered a damaging flood. With us is Gloria, director of that center. Yeah, thanks. Uh, anyone who wants to donate to the cleanup, check out our website. It's tax deductible. Wonderful. I'm donating 10% of my paycheck for this week and half of Jared's. Now I'm hearing Spider-Man may have been responsible for the flood. No way! Someone was responsible, but it wasn't Spider-Man. Follow the money. Who benefits from lower property values? And I'm going to stop you there, because we have a strict policy of not saying anything that will get me sued. Incidentally, I'm pretty sure Spider-Man can't afford lawyers. He wasn't Spider-Man. We're out of time. Thanks so much for joining us, Gloria. And remember, everyone, if you want to be a real hero, not like a certain masked menace. Donate to Feast. Jared, cut her mic before I end up in the poorhouse.
I should get back to looking for the new farm. Time to hit the theater. Something's not right. Someone check on Evan. I got this one. Run away, other people. That's an option. Hey, so despite the dead zone, I was able to ping an IP address, and it led me to an online underground forum. And it is gold. Really? Have you found anything good? Like how they started? They were wannabe mafia. Started with assaults and robberies, then went after bigger groups so they could earn a reputation. Like, oh, the inner demons. Demons, how things go. Not how you'd expect. When Devil's Breath hit, enough of the underground got sick that they went into hiding. And Martin Lee going to jail ended the demons. Yeah, the underground took over the demons' territory kind of by default. Not very dramatic.
Time to shut down the jammer. Let's see where it is. Wire run outs. Probably a good place to start. Jammer could be behind that door. Yep. Demon stuff. Spoils of war, I guess. demon mask never gonna stop hating the sight of these hard to imagine a sword and shield holding up against the firepower the underground has now need to shut down the jammer hey hideouts back on the grid nice tipping the cops off now I can't wait to write up this underground demons conflict for my podcast series. Thanks, Spider-Man. That's my cue to leave. I should get back to looking for the new farm. Time to hit the theater. underground hideout on the Upper East Side. Cool. You look for the jammer, I'll start pulling records for what the underground's been up to here.
Melissa, you there? Melissa? Someone check in on her. More! We need more people! Why are there always more of them than there are of me? Hey! Come out and face us! Hey, Spider-Man. I ran a custom search of this address with some underground-specific queries. This used to be a tombstone I asked. Whoa! What's the history there? The underground and tombstones crew did a few jobs together. Robberies, pits, carjackings. There was a falling out when a member killed one of Tombstone's guys. The underground were outgunned. Until the Tinkerer came along. Yeah, and by then Tombstone was in prison, so they were able to sweep in here, no problem. I know you! write your intro music? Uh, I dated a guy for like half a minute and he was nice enough to write my stinger before we broke up. Oh, if you ever need someone who mixes beats, I, uh, I know a guy. That would be amazing, because I am totally tone deaf. We can end this fast or slow. Your Heading choice. over to their position. Are you there? Melissa? Someone check in on her. I just need to find the jammer and shut it down. Shouldn't be too heavy. And it was it. There's the jammer. They kept trophies from their fights with Tombstone. How sentimental. Makes your skin nearly invulnerable. Pete ended up creating a counter drug to stop it. Hope the underground aren't getting into this. One of Tombstone's bikes. Of course he'd have a big muffler. I mean, I think that's a muffler. Mannequins move? 
See another mannequin. Hey, hideout should be back on the grid. Okay, tipping off the cops. Cool. I'm gonna chase the Tombstone Underground Partnership lead for my series. I should head out before the cops get here and cover everything in crime tape. I've been checking on all the hideouts we've shut down. Recruiting's tanked, and those blocks have gotten way safer. That's great. Thanks for calling them in. I wouldn't have found the jammers without you. So, I was looking through my files. It seems like the Tinkerer was working on some big secret project in Hell's Kitchen. Is it new form related? No, it looks like... programmable matter? I've faced that stuff before. Maybe I should take it off her hands. Oh, hey, there's a code here. 2658. Maybe try that if you find something, you know, locked? 2658. Got it. Thanks again, Danica, for doing your podcast. Those tips at the end of your episodes have been life-changing. Oh, well, I'm glad. Thanks. When my Underground series is out, let me know what you think. Sounds good to me. Talk to you later. Okay, I should see if Finn hit the new form in the gem theater. into anything. Oh, I'm digging this. Think that'll do it. I kind of think Danica for the tip. Okay, I should see if Finn hit the new form in the gym theater. Okay, I should see if Finn hit the new form in the gem theater. You're right, Genki. Underground are everywhere. You might say they're overground? <sighs> Keep working on that one. <clears throat> Barriers electrified. Ow! And not friendly. 
Your suit says that was 300 kilojoules. How is that just ow? Benefits of bioelectricity, I guess. Power can be supplied all locally. Any sign of the power source? <laughs> Several. Bet these cables lead the way. Electrified barrier is next level. Maybe they got nervous after someone infiltrated Fisk Tower. Who do that? You look so peaceful, knocked out. Gotta drain that generator. All right, drained it. Feeling good. Now for the others. Check in on her. Spider-Man and Rock's on against us. We can, as long as we 
we keep following our Keep up this momentum after we break rocks, son. You're scared. As Spider-Man or Rocks on play you both. One of you people almost wiped us out before we went this public. Crap! Something's over there! Everybody, I found wet! Gotta be Spider-Man! Oh. I'll find Spider-Man! Just give me a minute! Gonna make a trophy out of your guy! Fresh out of power. And prime for smashing. <laughs> that was the way to the main auditorium. Now it's blocked. Oops. Maybe there's a staircase. Or an elevator. Like that elevator. If I can lift it. Hey, man, I'm thinking. What if you told Finn you're Spider-Man? Yo, Finn. Not only did I lie about joining your club, but I'm also the guy trying to stop you. Okay, yeah. We can work on the delivery. <clears throat> Giant armored silo looks promising. Like my gaming rig is underpowered right now. Yeah, Finn's going full supervillain layer here. Are you seeing this giant armor container thing? Totally not suspicious. You think the new form's in there? I got a hunch, yeah. Hey, 
machine has got cables running away from it. I wonder. Rick's invention. Krieger doesn't understand new form well enough to make more, but Finn does. She mapped out how his reactivity works. That's one. Need to power the others. So why do you think I should tell Finn I'm Spider-Man? Don't you think she might react badly? Let's make a pros and cons list. Uh. Pro, she's your best friend. Besides me. Con, she's a tinkerer. Pro, talking to her is easier than sneaking around behind her back. Con, the other Spider-Man was super clear. Don't tell anyone who you are. You told me. Maybe if she knows it's you she's fighting, she'll rethink the whole tinkerer thing. Maybe you're right. Finn's feeding rocks on bad intel so they don't get close to her or the new form. She's good. Finn's working on destabilizing the new form gradually, making it reactive but not explosive on contact. Why? So she can keep moving it? No one's here. I could look around some. Looks like Finn's making... A new mask? A shield? <sighs> Soon as I find a way around the underground's weapons, she comes up with something new. Drywall's falling apart. <laughs> Finn's been making new weapons to deal with me. Guess she told the rest of the underground to keep tabs. <laughs> All right, that's two. Hope this is a good idea. What's the worst that could happen? Says the guy 30 blocks away. Line of sight to the generator. Can't make a direct connection. Might be able to use that relay node to run a daisy chain. Three down. One to go. Promising. I gotta check in the supercomputer. All right, what do you 
up to, Finn? Finn's pumping energy into the new form, making it unstable like my Venom did. Which exploded the bridge. So... what? Does she want to blow up the theater? <sighs> Not the theater. Roxxon Plaza. Whoa, what? That's... how could she... It's not open yet, so there'd be no casualties. But I can't let her do this. I'm taking a new form. Come on. Come on! Crap, crap, crap! Spread out! It's here somewhere! I need to get the new form. After I deal with her glow stick army. Just to put it out there, what if Finn's right, and this is the best way to beat Roxxon? Finn's not just talking about throwing a rock through a window. She wants to blow up a building. Oh my god. If any part of her plan goes wrong, people will get hurt. I can't let her take that chance. You're right. Let's get that new form out of here. Oh! 
Our words. How about you stop being so flingy? Oh, she's not tired yet. It is not going well. Where are you? I don't know. I'm dodging explosions. I need a new strategy. I'm gonna do what you said. I tell her the truth? Yeah, as soon as I catch her. Tinkerer! I gotta tell you something! Slow down! Do you think I'm stupid? You wanna hear this! I promise! Get off, Spider-Man! reason not to end you. My mom would be very upset. Miles? Can we just... You two on the roof! my place I'm actually at home my parents get back next week so I thought I'd clean but I can come back nah it's okay I'll call you later now what hey uncle Aaron I need um I need some advice about what exactly just everything are you free I can wrap up what I'm doing call you in a few Thanks, man. Talk to you soon. I have no idea where Finn is, or the new form. Guess I should kill some time to Uncle Aaron's free. <laughs> 